Hi, greetings. Wait. Da -da -dum -dum. Hi, greetings to you, beautiful soul. These are tarot card messages for zodiac sign Cancerian. Alright, so what I'm getting is that you were right. They were mad, upset, and they were jealous. But I feel like they are actually in regret and remorse right now. Alright, you were right that they were jealous over you, how hardworking you are, how flexible, how, how intelligent, how smart, how um, articulate, how on point, you know, how real, how sovereign. Like, someone was just so jealous over your entire beingness, how courageous, how bold how true to yourself like someone was jealous about everything that you are this person could be a leo or they were in leo energy someone was jealous of that energy that you put out for it so maybe you're chasing your dreams you're living your passion it's you're, you're you're excited you're you're standing up for something you're vigorous and passionate you're confident you're courageous you're using your voice you're using your truth you're putting yourself first, you're not being intimidated, you're opening your chakras, you're talking up about things that this person is not talking. Yeah, so while you are like courageous, this person is the pan you san san yan. You know what I'm saying? Like, while you are being bold and courageous, this person in themselves is feeling like a, a real opposite of a lion. You know the word I'm saying? This person feels like a cat. And you feel like a courageous lion. So that's why they were always jealous of you. You were so right. You were just vigorous. And, and full of vitality. And this person, maybe they wanted to be like you. But they felt like they could not. So this was the kind of person that you felt like. They wanted to be little you when they got the chance to be little you. They thought to use mind games on you. They thought to slow you down. They thought to cast you out. They thought to make others not believe in you. They thought to, to like look at you with their negative energies to try project negative energy on ne energy onto you. They tried to make it look like you were the cat. And they had to group up with others to bring you down when you stand alone. And they know that everything that they see in you is true. <laughs> but it's like it was too good to be true. Look, I'm telling you, you're the one with the good the good of the good the good mind, the good spirit, the good body, the good everything. The Empress and the strength. Good good everything. Not just good body, good everything. You're you're all you're everything, you're the best. Like from this person or these people look at you. Hear you, feel your vibration, feel your energy. They know you are the empress, the realist, the original. You're like the divine. You're, you're, you come off the divine. You're no doubt like one of the best ever in your class or the best. They know it. They know they can't stand next to you. They know it in whatever field you are in. Like you have... um. Let's say you work, you are a woman and you work with a group of men. Some of the, the wives and like significant others of these men that you work with, they look at you and they're jealous. They're upset because they're like, oh, look at her. She's like so good or she's like awesome. She's amazing. So they're worried. Look, I'm telling you and you're confident. You're beautiful and you're very good at everything that you do. You write well, you speak well, you communicate well, you're hardworking, you're intelligent, you have your boundaries, you're independent, your your life, you're beautiful, you take care of your nails, your your what you wear is different. You're just outstanding. You're you're royal. You're in your own class. You're in your own class, baby. That's what I'm saying, and I feel like a lot of your lifestyle is changing. Where. You're out here manifesting a life of your dreams like luxury, fruitfulness, abundance. Alright? High Priestess, oh my goodness. You're literally in a class of your own Cancerian. Very much so. And I feel like most high 
made it to be so for you and there is so much to come and you probably don't even realize sometimes the tough the fight that you went through but i'm telling you you went through a lot you went through a whole lot because of even competition jealousy and people that wanted to push you over to take your place but i feel like the time has come where you are reinstated no doubt about it the tr all of those who wanted to come up act like they're you act like they're prettier than you nicer than you um you are just naturally beautiful i feel like for a while you you allow them their time to shine or for them to speak or whatever but now it's your time to present it's your time to be big and bold and beautiful it's your time for the truth of you to radiate for you to be your best self for you to really dominate the class that you are in the level you're in your league your tier your top tier i'm telling you you're a top tier woman i'm feeling like a lot of divine feminines with the strength high priestess and empress very much top tier top class very much top top tier top class in every book in everyone's book you could be a teacher a principal like very bright very official prime time very royal very special very spiritual like in a high class like you take first class first class flights everything like you know what i'm saying even like your your mindset your philosophical mindset like people feel like you were just given or maybe you were just given the best of everything you're very bright you're good looking you write well you speak well you you're you're physically attractive you're just all well-rounded Plus you're confident, plus you you know the truth of who you are, plus you're humble, you're good at manifesting, you're strong, plus you're courageous, you're good at speaking and rallying up a crowd if you want to, you're connected to most high, high principles, you're a leader, you know, you are a leader, director, and there are people that are taking a step back now as they have they have to come to, to address you differently now something about romance or romance or something someone may be moving in in some way shape or form yeah because there's someone from your past that is looking for you this could be a past family member member or a past friend but there are people that still check in for you in some way, beautiful soul, that they want to get to you, but you seem to be not easily accessible. You may be very busy, very productive, very creative right now, very wrapped up in your orders. I hear orders and then I hear sheen. So, so you may be getting some products online, shopping online or something, or closing some deals. Yeah, this is the death card so i'm seeing something that you didn't expect is changing yeah with that death card but i i hear that it is something good something good is coming in because of an ending that has happened this is gonna be so good i feel like whatever is coming into your hands it's gonna be really good it's something you deserve after a hard time you're going to get your independence or something, maybe paperwork, documents, something, a blessing coming true. Something working out in your favor that you've been waiting for a, a good while, I feel like. You had yeah, something having to do with documents. You had like some opposition as well in some way. All right. With the karmic energy. Yeah. And the death energy of that um, coffin. Death energy repeated. So something from your past, but I feel like you're not stuck on it anymore, whatever it is, because you're, 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 you've freed yourself, you've loosened whatever bounds, you've loosened them already, you're free. So maybe for some people it's too late. Maybe it's too late because you've moved on or you're already setting yourself free. But maybe someone is thinking of um coming toward you maybe this is a family member or someone that um loves you but we'll see yeah because this person is sad someone is sad we have the five of cups 
Five of Wands. Yes, yeah, someone is sorry. I think I started the reading by saying someone is regretful for something that they did. You know, or like maybe it, it was a prayer reading where someone didn't choose you. Yeah, but now they're feeling so remorseful, so regretful, and you're just oh, so upstanding. You're just, you're closed off, but it's like you're in a higher, high, you're in the high priestess energy. You know, like you're, you've become a high spiritual master. You've leveled up spiritually, physically, psychically, telepathically. You're in a different zone, a different league. But this person is trying to get to you. But the message that I think you can still sense them or read their energy. But they're really trying to connect with you. Right? Oh my gosh. And I feel a lot of income. A lot of um, well-being. Yeah, for real. For generations. That you're, you're manifested. You're manifested. To, you've, you've really changed your life. You've like a transformation, like from a butter, from from a caterpillar to a butterfly. You've like blossomed or bloomed into your full spiritual self. You've matured a lot with that Empress, the Strength card, and the High Priestess. You've done a lot of work, healing work on your chakras, on your senses, on your nerves, deep healing. That's why you're you're in a high vibration. You're just radiating, levitating highly. You know what I'm saying? So this person that's missing you is literally like longing to connect with you. This person or a situation that is missing you. This is the Nine of Swords and the Death card. Okay? But we'll see what happens in the next one, beautiful soul. All right. I feel like this person is going to make some move to come toward you. Yeah, yeah. I was saying, yes, you were right. Yes, you were right. They were karmic and they were jealous and they were lying and stuff like that with that death energy. So you were right. So now I feel like you've you've like protected yourself with your divine powers or powers or you have someone that is guiding you and protecting you. And now they feel baffled and they feel like locked out of your energy. And some of them are looking at you like this, but, you know. So let's let's clarify this Ace of Pentacles. Let us see. Because this is a lot of abundance that is that you are generating. And I feel like you're smiling. A new home, a new business, a new car, a new, a new place. You're smiling. You're happy of, about this fulfillment that is coming your way. All right. Yeah, and this is something that you you deserve this ace of diamonds okay all right and it's coming from a far away too the sun i'm telling you this is abundance that is coming in the queen of diamonds you're gonna get this to this place of liberation abundance joy success in abundance and maybe they're gonna be mad but you're 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 not gonna care. You're just gonna love your the abundance that is coming into your hands. That's what you're gonna just love it so much. You're gonna feel confident and a bit boastful, like ah ha ha ha! I got what's mine. But like they're gonna be mad and you're gonna be glorious in abundance. And I love it. So take it easy and enjoy it. Much love to you. All is well. All is within you. We'll talk about this some more in our next reading. Because I feel like some of these people are people that did wrong to you, you know. Because in the beginning of the reading, I was saying some of them wanted to, like, belittle you, outcast you, put you down. Because you were confident, you were beautiful, you were royal. You were the center of attention, you were vigorous, you were, you were embodying the truth of yourself. And so they, it's like they got jealous and they wanted that for themselves or something. They... You strong Leo energy and the energy you give off is magnetizing. It's radiant and wealthy energy like prosperity and luxury. So be aware, be ready. Love you. Take it easy out there. Like this video, share, comment, subscribe, claim in the comment section. Big up yourselves. I'll catch you in the next one. And thanks.